Hey guys and welcome back to my channel and today's video is inspired by Deepika Padukone's makeup which she wore for MTV EMA awards so if you are interested then please keep on watching so I'm gonna grab my eyebrow pencil and I'm gonna start off by filling my brows so I am brushing up using a spoolie which comes with the pencil and I'm gonna use the other side to just fill in my brows this one is basically by MAC and to be very honest I'm not really fond of this particular brow pencil so you can basically use whatever you have at home Now I'm gonna start off with my eyes and for that I'm taking Lakme Absolute Cool Pencil and I'm running this onto my waterline and upper waterline as well and make sure you sharp your pencils otherwise you might hurt yourself just like me. Now I'm using the gel eyeliner again from Lakme and I'm going to use it as my base and since it's a dark color it's perfect for a smoky eye and it's great because it's going to hold on to my makeup as well and it will prevent my makeup from creasing also. Now I'm using a fluffy blending brush and a matte brown eyeshadow and I'm going to place this color onto my crease area and if you notice I am going back and forth and I'm trying to go in circular motion just to blend out the product and yes I'm using my empty color bar compact because it is magnetic so I can just put my magnetic um, refills onto it and use it and it turned out to be a perfect combination. And as usual, I'm blending out the same color onto my lower lash line as well. So now I'm taking a black eyeshadow from Inglot and a small detailer brush. You can use any other flat eyeshadow brush for this step and you're gonna just pack the color onto your eyelid and make sure you avoid the crease area. Now I'm taking up the same blending brush which I used earlier I'm gonna blend out the edges and basically I'm blending out the two lines where the black and brown meets uh, so that it looks more diffuse and blended. So I applied my mascara and my lashes off camera and now I am applying a black eyeshadow using a pencil brush from color bar onto my lower lash line just to smoke it out a bit. So now I'm using a shimmer iridescent shade on a pencil brush just to brighten up my inner corner area. So for my foundation, I am mixing up my Studio Fix Fluid with Revlon Illuminator just to get more thinner consistency and to get more dewy finish and I am using my Real Technique Expert Face Brush to apply that foundation all over my face and I am just buffing out the color into my skin to get more natural finish. So for the concealer I am using my trusty select cover up concealer from MAC and I am just applying it under my eyes and around my mouth area and I am going to blend this color out with my Real Technique Expert Face Brush again and the reason why I love this concealer is because it's very natural and it gives satin finish and for a person like me who has dry skin it works really wonder. So for the powder I'm using again a loose powder just so that it won't add much coverage to my face and I am using some local blush brush to do that work because it's more fluffier. 
yes i'm using the same color bar empty compact as my palette and i poured some product onto that just so that i can use it more easily so for my blush i'm using a blush from benefit which comes with the kit so i will leave all the details in the description bar below so make sure you check that out and i'm using the same blush brush but apparently the color was not coming that nicely so i had to change both of the products so now i'm using a bronzer on a more denser blush brush and kind of giving definition to my face a little bit and just adding more color to my face Last but not the least I'm using a lipstick but before that I prefer to line my lips because it gives more definition to my lips so I'm using a Nykaa lipstick which they recently launched and I do have a review of the same on my blog as well which I will definitely link on the side so you can go and check that out as well So that's the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed this look and if you did, please do subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up. It will help me a lot and I'll see you really soon in my next video. Till then stay bronze and keep on blushing.